Today, we're trying one of our rice, rice culverts that we haven't tried in a while. If you remember this video from the past, being here, this water usually soars through here. But, it's so low right now, they're not, I guess they're not pumping water through their fields because they don't really have to because it's starting to cool off and it's been pretty wet lately. So there, there is absolutely no current coming through here and this water is clearing up. It's clear enough you can use lures and I didn't really bring any. I brought uh, like two or three that's in a tin can. But I'm just going to try my luck with worm and bobber. I'm going to try to get some crappie, bass, red ears, and bluegill or whatever bites. I've never seen this place this low before. It's super low. Completely dead. No current at all. But here's uh, what I meant. I said it was clear. If you look over there, you can see the bottom in a foot of water. You can completely see the bottom. <laughs> same. Same thing. All right, me and Wilma both just caught little six, seven inch channel cats. Little babies. And they are babies. Yearlings just was born this year. Take it under. Got him. Regular bluegill. Not very big either. About five inches, guys. So we got two channels and a bluegill. There we go. Oh, yeah. Man. Big bluegill. <coughs> Big old bluegill. That's a nice one. Now that's what I came after, guys. That's a decent bluegill there. Yes, indeed. Regular bluegill? No, nope, red ear. Really tiny, though. They do. Yep. So small you can't tell. All right, guys, little baby red ear. He just don't have a red flap yet. He's too small. Guys, I got a large mouth out of the gutter. Right on the edge of the gutter. Yeah. I knew it was bigger when he started pulling. I thought it was a catfish again, though. I thought for sure. I always get one bass here every time, just like Mingo here. 
Then I gotta change my battery after this. Alright guys, a little large mouth, nothing to brag about. Half pounder. <laughs> but it is a different kind, I guess. Oh, Ooh, this is a big one. Big one. Oh my. Maybe it's the best again. Oh, oh. My oh my god. This oh, is I told you. I told you it was a big one. You're going to have to get the dip net. All right, guys. I got a bow fin. Three inches from the bank. Oh my. Now that's a surprise. I knew right away he, he, the way he was pulling. I, I just knew it wasn't no bluegill. No. The bad thing is it's going to scare all the fish away. <clears throat> scared the fish. Yep. Oh my god. <laughs> you need to pull up. It's going to read. Hmm? It's too far. <laughs> pull up. Okay. Hold my pole. Grab the butt of mm. my pole and just don't do nothing with it. Don't fill up the water. Almost had him. I got it. All right, guys. All right. Catch of the day so far. All right. Yeah. <clears throat> there we go. Something worth coming for anyway. He's about four pounds, three pounds. About 22 inches. All right. Heck yes. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to have pliers on him. That definitely scared the fish for a little while, unfortunately. I told you before, I even knew it was big, though. I just knew, I could just tell by the way it was constantly pulling that it wasn't a bluegill or a small catfish. I knew it was something real. I was right. Okay, I'm going to... Need you to film me. I'm just gonna get my gloves on. Just to be safe. And then I'll have you film me. Okay. I guess come on back. And you can film me. Not a bad little bow fin for here. It's, for here, it's decent. They don't get real big in this place. <sighs> oh, good. Trying to get the grass off. All I did was cause more grass. <sighs> all right, guys. Nice little bow fin. Just a little three pounder, but I'm happy with it. Made it worth coming anyway. Okay. <laughs> Thanks. He sure stirred up, stirred up this water. Yes. And he's been beating the hell out of his tail. I didn't do that. I don't know what he's beating it against. The <laughs> gutter or something, maybe it sticks. I don't know. God. All right, guys, I'm gonna let him go in this gutter or over here. Already scared the water enough. Ah, <sighs> not bad. Mm. 
Whoa. Ugh. Mm. Something wrong with it. That's a parasite. Farm fertilizers, probably. I don't want to touch him. Man, it's humid. It's not hot, but it's humid. My whole face is wet. I don't know where I throw. Right here. All right, I want a picture of me holding this one too. I'm getting a variety now. I'll do it. I'll just set it on the camera, uh, on the backpack. That ain't, that ain't a bad red ear. Yeah. All right, guys, I got me a shell cracker, AKA red ear. Gotten a lot of kinds now, five species. That's my second red ear. The first one was so small you couldn't tell it was a red ear. This is a male red ear. Not bad. I like them. Yes, I love me some red ears. We ended up doing all right. It's not bad. Yeah. It's not huge, but. Catchable. You got something big. Oh, that's not bad. You're not a bad bluegill. He's hand size. Well, get behind me to take it. Swallow the hook. Just go behind me. Oh, God. Swallow. Mm. Somebody's what? chasing. Oh, yeah. Get it. You got a big. Oh, my. <laughs> You're going to have to let me sit down below you here. Yeah. I can't fish. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Bluegill? I don't know. Yeah. Not bad. Red ear? No, it's a bluegill. Mm -hmm. <laughs> see, you see it to me. Oh, got one already. Yeah. I got him. There's something about at that spot out there. I don't, maybe because it gets shallow again. It's probably not deep. All right, guys, we just got double blue eels. There's something about a little spot out there. We don't know why, but they love it. Well, guys, that ends this episode. Didn't do bad, but didn't do good. It was just kind of mediocre. At least I did get the both in. I was hoping to get at least one or two crappie. Didn't get any crappie and no warm mouth. And I'd like to get a surprise carp or buffalo, but that didn't happen either. Or gar or nothing like that. Other than that, I did get red ear bass, bluegill and both in, and channel cats. All in all, it was okay. Like I said, could have been better, could have been worse. Until next time, hit that like button and please subscribe.